Hi. <laughs> how is it? What, how is it April? I feel like I've blinked and like half the year's gone by. It's absolutely madness. Um, I've just been sat in my car. I had a... Uh, hi. Hi. Welcome back. Mwah. <laughs> um, <clears throat> it's lovely to see you, firstly. I have just been with Maggie for brunch um, at one. I'm just going to run you through my day. Let's just pretend like I haven't been away. <laughs> I've just been at brunch with Maggie from one until half three. It's Saturday. What date is it? It's Saturday, the 22nd of April, 2023. I did. Okay, stay with the thought, Lauren. Stay with the thought. Yeah, brunch. <laughs> I did brunch with Maggie and then I asked Maggie to help me take some donations that were in my car to the charity shop, but I hadn't sorted them out. So my car, obviously, like my life, is carnage. So we did that, had some gossiping in the car. I got back to my car at half three. That doesn't make sense. Four. Four? Okay, I got back... Uh, okay, I've just sat in my car for an hour, just not doing anything, because I was planning to sort out my car when I got here because I had three coats and five pairs of shoes in the car, which is ridiculous. So I had plans when I was sitting in the car. I was like, oh, I'll um, come in and do a little vlog, da, da, but I've taken my bra off now. So, <laughs> oh, does anyone else do that? When you take your bra off, it's like game over. Um, so as always, my house is a complete state, um, and I thought I'd be real about it because I have been struggling. Mind the little shorts. I've been struggling with keeping my flat tidy. Uh, things have been difficult since I last did a last video. A lot has happened. I filmed Christmas stuff. I filmed New Year stuff. Um, I filmed Christmas Day. And then I just like shut down. Like, yeah. I did like a human after Vlogmas. Blinked and now we're nearly in May. So next week, two weeks time is my birthday, which is again, madness. Um, but what I wanted to do today was also, look, neon, isn't it lovely? This cut, this hand's different slightly. This one is Barry M. Oh, I can't be bothered to find it. Um, yeah, and this one is model's own. Yeah, did them myself. As you know, because... Because of what I just said, in the fact that I struggle with doing anything for myself inside my own flat. No, actually, that's a lie. So I have been working from home for the last two weeks because my mum and dad are having a complete kitchen refurb, which is very exciting. But that means that my dad's doing all the work for the kitchen refurb and my mum is at a loose end. So she was getting stressed with not being able to help with the kitchen and then I was getting stressed at her getting stressed and we were both like so I was like you know what I'm going to take myself out of the equation and work from home aka bed for the foreseeable so I've just been literally living here working in bed festering like the grandparents in Ch Charlie and the Chocolate Factory um in bed for like two weeks um and yeah, so I saw something on TikTok the other day where this girl also struggled with um, ow, doing jobs 
and sorting her life out. So she bought a dice, but it's not a normal die. This one is from Dungeons and Dragons. I got these on, they were like a pack of five uh, on Amazon and it's got 20 sides on it. So what you do is, this is obviously you're doing top, am I making sense? Are you following? Anyway, basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a list of 20 things that I need to do in this house. For instance, take out the recycling, put a wash on, sort out that drawer, clear my bloody sofa, um, change my bed, which I only did last week, but then I dripped, I had, um, I dripped, on, anyway, don't, don't follow that sentence through. I had a Marmite butter croissant and no, Marmite butter crumpet, and I didn't use a plate and I just came over and it dripped all over the, dripped all over the bedding. So it looked, yeah, anyway, it does not look great. So I need to change my Marmitey bedding because this is real life. This is my real life. And sometimes I get embarrassed about showing this side of things because it's not, you know, I know also a lot of people get triggered when I show my mess, like you need to tidy up. I mean, that's very rare. It's very rare for anyone to say anything like that. But, but so basically I'm gonna make a list, then I'm gonna roll the dice and then whatever the dice says, I'm gonna do it. So we're gonna like gamify clearing up. Okay, one sec. So this is what we this is what we're dealing with. This is what I bought in from the car. <laughs> <laughs> this is this. Uh, this is this. And oh my god, I do not want to show you in here. But I'm gonna awful, just awful. <sighs> Let me shut this. I feel like oh god, can you see my bum? Wait, there we go, hi. Um, I feel like when, I feel like when you struggle with anxiety, etc., and you're in like a slump of living in it, living in your, living in what you've done, <laughs> it can feel really embarrassing and you can't get out of it like a little shame pit. Um, and I kind of want to show it because a lot of the time I'll tidy up to do a video or I'll, well, if I even do one, or I'll hide it all or whatever. But this is what I want to do today. I want to do some jobs and you're going to come with me. Where's my clip? I think it's over here. <sighs> oh, what did I just sit on? Right. What colour should we choose? Oh, it's already on pink. Uh, let's choose pink. Okay. So this has up to 20. One. <laughs> Get a life. One. Um, change. Bedding. Two, take out, take out recycling, three, put away clothes, four, wash up, five, Put wash on six hoover seven <sighs> dance party for five minutes. You need to put something nice in there. Eight. Drink. <laughs> Some. Water. Nine. <sighs> Twelve. 
put away stuff in suit case. 10. Put away shoes. You know what? I think 10 is good. These were the other die that I got. Does that one go? Does that go to 10? Bear with. Oh. Yeah, it's got it's got ten sides on it. Cool. And we'll just use the zero as ten. Awesome. Oh no, that's ten. Okay. Are we ready? <sighs> okay. Three. Oh no, why is it the worst one? <laughs> why is it the worst one? So many clothes to put away. Let's do, I'm gonna feel better, you're gonna feel better, Lauren. You're gonna feel better, and you're gonna feel better if you put away some clothes. We're all gonna feel better if we put away some clothes. <laughs> oh, what I also wanted to do was sort out that Kallax. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, um, I'm going to right here, sort, Kallax. Um, so when I've done this, I'll replace it with this. Okay, let's go. Hair is up. Bra is on. Okay, we have an issue. I had to get some shoes out. I had to get some shoes out the other day. So my shoes are all over the floor when they're normally in there. So I need to put my shoes away first before... I can open this realistically. Okay, I just had a sit down. Um, we have done very well, but I haven't been filming it because the thought of putting my little GoPro at all these angles and filming my body at all these angles put me off doing the job. So I was like, right, if I can just do the job, that's better. So look, oh wait, let me get my, I bought some of those like um, chub rub shorts from well these ones are just from yours but they're basically just tights but you wear them under your skirt and they're just like this because my legs always rub and it absolutely changed my life i used to wear like these little cycling shorts but they were really thick and they made me really hot but those are absolutely amazing um hashtag bought with my money you know that guys um so look we're getting we're getting through it oh my god it looks absolutely horrendous through the camera i mean through my eyes also but through the camera so we're doing good i've been doing some art though anyway my cupboard is looking very organized my shoes are here ready to be put away in there and yeah oh i need to water that plant this one oh. that was close <laughs> oh, sorry my love oh my god it's so oh my god all the things are... <gasps> quick get it in water quick blue star fern just throw them out the window okay let's keep going keep going Momentum, momentum. So I've got down to like base level so far and I'm just like finding really random things. Um, secateurs, maybe not too random. Uh, that mini cross stitch I bought at, I was gonna say candy cane then, Hobbycraft at Christmas that I never did, but I do want to do. Um, jar of anchovies. Uh, one of those pin sentry things that needs to go in that drawer. Um, face cream. Silver polishing cloth. Some doorknobs, some little drawer knobs that I never opened. Sharpie. Tin of black olives. Plant pot. 
a thank you note from an artist because I bought a print. Um, yeah. And obviously some sea glass because sea glass follows me wherever I am. And uh, jade roller, pink quartz actually, pink quartz roller um, and some toxic waste because... I don't think you know that about me. I absolutely love, sorry, it's way too close. I absolutely love toxic, <laughs> toxicity. Um, I love drama. No, I do love drama, but also I love toxic sweets. Why can I not open this? I've literally had some of these. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, this is sour cherry. they don't make sour sweet sour anymore like back in the day tang plastics used to be like but now <laughs> mm, love it okay so we've got quite a drastic update <laughs> i've been thinking for a while that i want to get rid of my sofa um and i got rid of my sofa so <clears throat> well sofa's down there because wait, oh god I need a water <sighs> hydration guys <Ooh. sighs> hydration <sighs> right let me actually just sit down <sighs> there's nowhere to sit now got rid of a sofa as you know all I ever do is put crap on that whole sofa I never use it, it stresses me out um my friend Amy once said to me I've never known anyone to use a sofa as storage <laughs> not in like a mean way just in like a observatory way so um Oh my God, I completely zoned out then. I found earlier on Facebook Marketplace, this um, Ikea um, Poang. So I went to Ikea on Thursday night with my lovely neighbor, Vanessa. And it was so funny. She was like, we were walking around looking at chairs because I thought I'd rather get a singular chair because I got a sofa for when I have friends round but realistically I never have anybody over because well my flat's always a tip and for instance the only person the only friend of mine who comes over is Charlie and we sit in bed and all my friends I'd be completely comfortable just to sit in my bed with them or to sit at the table because my other chair is up above my thing so I was like right I'm just gonna get a chair for one for me so, I found this, um, she had it on for 40, and I offered 20, <clears throat> um, let me see if I can show you, yeah, this lovely Ikea Poang chair, so, light green cotton, it looks really gorgeous, I need to get my, I need to get cash out. So I'm going to go and collect it tomorrow. So then I was like, right, I need to get rid of my sofa. Um, I had it on Facebook Marketplace for 150 even though I got it for free. <laughs> even Well, I got it for free, but I had to pay for a zip car to go get it. Um, but then I was like, you know what? I got such a good deal with it. I want to give someone else a good deal. So I put it on, um, I put it on Olio and this woman snapped it up within five minutes and she was like, can we come tonight? We've been sitting on beanbags. We're so tired of sitting on beanbags. So they're coming in about an hour. Yeah, they're coming at half 10 in an hour to come collect my sofa. So now I've got all this space for activities. 
Is it raining? No, it was just my hair. Yeah, so I managed to get, right, so the story of the sofa. The sofa does not fit out of my door without the legs off. So I've just had to remove all of the legs. Now I did three of the four with a knife because I didn't have an Allen key that fit. I had about 10 Allen keys and the one I needed was the one that was missing. It was like a mid-range one. Anyway, my amazing neighbour, Vanessa, mentioned before, um, had an Allen key. So she just came down, helped me remove the final leg. Then we put it out on the thing, as you just saw. So I'm going to give them the legs and I'm going to give them the things, the bolts. They might want to and, and they're going to strap it to the top of their car because they've got a roof rack apparently so <laughs> oh they're just driving away with it now on their roof oh <laughs> they were like they were so lovely this young couple this young couple um she was so grateful but when they were like strapping it to the roof i was like ah! And yeah, now look. Space. I just want to go to bed now. I'm just knackered. So I'm going to clear away. I'm going to clear this. As in, put it on the floor. And then get to bed. And the plan is to do a little take you with me tomorrow. And then edit this tomorrow and shove it up this week. That's the plan. Good night. Good morning, good morning. I have returned and it is in fact the next day. Oh my God. I've just cleansed my face with some oil, Bobbi Brown. I've got it free, obviously. Bobbi Brown oil cleanser because I had waterproof mascara on last night. And you know, after you cleanse your face and you don't moisturize, and you feel like you're wearing a mask that you can't breathe on, out of. That's how I feel. So I'm just going to put some moisturiser on. Literally, I'll just put you there because it's here. <laughs> <laughs> if I were a fish. Oh, what is it called? If I were a fish and you called me, you'd say, look at that fish. Pretty ass in the sea. You'd win first prize if you caught me. Shimmering in the sun. Hi. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um, hi, morning voice. Hi. Welcome to Live It Like Lauren. Also, can we please have a round of applause, a standing ovation, if you will, for my new intro. I made that intro in December. <laughs> because I wanted to get some like funky things for Vogmas. I got like their month free trial which meant that I got loads of extras. So I downloaded a few different like intro things and I was like, when I start doing this full time again in January, I'll use this intro. P.S. Never happened. I even did the music. I did everything. I did it all. So when I wanted to make a video this week, well, I've wanted to make a video for a while. I was like, oh yeah, I got that intro. <clears throat> I slept well, slept really well. It's 10. What time is it? 10.08. It's 10.37 a.m. Oh, 10.37. <laughs> what? 10.37, okay. It's later than I thought it was. So, it feels really empty in here. Without my sofa, because normally my sofa's like right at the end of my bed. But it was really nice last night because I sometimes stretch my legs out without my blanket on because I don't like to have my feet inside the blanket when I sleep. And it was nice not to have them touching the sofa. My plan today is to have some breakfast. Oh my God, I need some water. This just looks like sewage at the top, at the pond water. It's because this is squash. I made up some squash and then just kept the mint in from the other day. It's quite nice. It's um apple, no orange and mango Robinson's creations with some mint. 
Mmm. Mocktail like. I mean, beggars can't be choosers. So I want to go to Chiswick. Did I want to go to Chiswick or did I just want to go to Chiswick for the art shop? I did, but the art shop is closed on Sundays. So I'm going to go to Kensington. And, oh, okay, stay on the thought. Kensington. And there's a cool art shop I've wanted to go to for years because I want to get some oil paints. Now, I have oil paints, but, I mean, I haven't used them since I was in school, which was one or two years ago now. So, I want to get some new oil paints because I've been loving doing some artwork with acrylics recently. Sorry, I used my earplugs last night, my loops. If you would like a, um, if you'd like a review on these, please let me know. Um, they do, I need to change the bud though, because they keep falling out of my ears, because they're the smallest ones. Um, ba -ba -ba. oils, school, yeah. <sighs> it's painful, honestly, it's painful to stay on the right thought. Okay, so, this video is going to be bloody long, but you love them, you love them long and big and long, don't you? So... <laughs> Stay on the thought. Do not go off on big and long. Anyway. <laughs> oh, the reason why I was thinking Chiswick because the the Poang chair I'm picking up is in Barnes. I'm excited. It's so interesting how I've always just set up this studio for two people, for like me plus somebody who's going to come around, a friend, whatever. Um, but it's just made me realise that I just have so much stuff. Like, even my kitchen, I was realising that it was this, this week. Like, the reason why I always have so much washing up is because I have so many plates, cups, what cutlery, everything. So, if I use a bowl and it's dirty, I just use another bowl and then another bowl and then another bowl. Because I'm too lazy, to, too lazy or whatever, insert adjective there, to wash up. And then before I know it, my tiny little kitchen in a cupboard. You weren't expecting that, were you? Kitchen in a cupboard, kitchen in a cupboard yeah is a mess i've got oh i've got life drawing tonight fat life drawing they have people of all genders all sizes well mostly fat mostly plus size people um modeling their beautiful bodies and we get to draw them which is excellent so i'm doing that tonight haven't done it since maybe a two year a year and a half two years now so First things first. What's first? I think a bit of festering. I think I might just fester for a bit longer. I'm dressed, but I got distracted. So I have something bit me in the night on my ankle. So I was in my drawer looking for uh, bite stuff, but then I obviously got distracted and found some temporary tattoos. So now I'm doing <laughs> temporary tattoo on my wrist. <laughs> because uh, why not? Why not? Hey, right, let's rest you on top of this water bottle. Oh, that works well, hello. So I've got this flannel that I've just cleansed my face with. Okay, we'll do the reveal together, huh? Oh, looks good. I put a temporary tattoo on a little while ago and posted a picture on Instagram and my sister, because I don't have any, my sister-in-law was like, what's that? <laughs> I was like, it's, it's fake. I think that looks pretty damn good. It's a bit shiny, but... But... Quite like that. Yeah. So this is turning green. I've got my donations. I'm gonna go to Bernardo's, I think.
Alright, I dropped them off. Now I'm coming to look in Farah. Look how gorgeous these dresses. So nice. So we've donated, we've been in the other shop and I did buy those shoes. <laughs> Cause they're really cute and I never buy, sh I haven't got any shoes like this. I haven't got any white shoes, any shoes that are not black. Um, they were 3.75, brand new ASOS. They seem really comfortable. Um, I thought they'd be good for the wedding I'm going to, but then I'm thinking maybe I can't wear white shoes, but it's a four day thing, it's fine. I'll ask the bride. White Hart Lane, 20 minute drive. Okay, cool. I'm gonna tell her I'm gonna be there in 20 minutes. And then we're gonna have to probably rearrange the car to get the chair in. But I'd rather see the chair first before I have to rearrange everything. Yeah, fun. That was a touch screen, bloody cash point. Oh, you can tell I rarely get cash out, the fact that that impressed me. What a loser. Oh, let me check if she's texted me back. Sure, Lauren, I'm here. Great, Martina. That's great news. This um, garage is literally... Oh, he's staring at me. This is probably because I'm talking to myself. This garage is literally two streets over from where I used to live in Chiswick and it's always weird when I come back here. All the memories, all the terrible, terrible memories. Is it telling me to go South Parade? Okay, I think I've got to go this way. this park here, South Acton playing fields, I think it's called South Acton Green, even though this is a W4 Boys code, so it's Chiswick. Anyway, um, they had one of those like stalls for selling Christmas trees. And I remember once driving back past it on Christmas day and there were loads of trees that hadn't been sold and they were just laying there in the wet, in the dark on Christmas day. And I felt really sorry for them. And that whenever I drive past that, that bit of green, I think of those sad little trees that didn't get to experience Christmas and they died for nothing. You know, just my normal casual, let's go to Chiswick thoughts. Well, that's the least of my worries, but am I gonna let this bike through? Yes, there you go. My brakes are so squeaky. Okay, it's telling me to go down here. Okay, okay. weird the song that just came into my head no I'm never gonna survive all this you get a little crazy no I'm never gonna survive oh, you get a little I think this suits me quite a lot I think it's gonna be easiest if I put this down Yeah, there we go. Oh my goodness. We had 
to get it down three flights of stairs. <sighs> but it's in. I might not be able to see out the back window, but we'll just have to drive extra carefully. Oh, I'm going forward. Yeah, don't drive when you're filming though. Um, oh my goodness, I need a drink. <sighs> Hi, editing Lauren here. Um, this was meant to be a nice little slow video of me in the art shop, but I accidentally filmed it on time lapse. So here is me feeling all the brushes up because they felt so good. Um, and who knew there were so many brushes? Yeah, um, these ones look like little sugared almonds. Anyway, enjoy. So here we are on Kensington High Street. I was not confident enough to video on the high street because there were just too many people. Um, um, I just spent, well, so I got my Poang and she was so lovely. Yeah, we, oh my God, I was absolutely sweating after bringing all that stuff, um, moving all the stuff in my car, I had to move it all around even more. And I managed to get, can you see that box behind me? Um, she was an artist and she was giving away canvases as well. So I got, cause I got out 30 quid and I got those two massive canvases for 10 pounds. Uh, for two um, and she was like do you want anything else I was like well if you do me them for two for ten I'll take them she was like yeah <laughs> she was really lovely um, really cool she had like really short hair and it was the kind of like effortless cool hair that I dream about but then think I would have a fit if I cut my long, well, my hair, because I even hate it this length. Oh my God, how many tangents can we say in one sentence, Lauren? So, oh, I just spent some money, which was felt good because I love spending money. Um, even though my bank account does not love me spending money. Um, and I got, I used my little Ikea. So Ikea did this, do the big one. In a little one so I've got my little bag it's so cute I got some oils I got some oil paper I got some white acrylic paint I got some brushes hmm. I think I did well today especially because what I spent on the paper what I spent on all of that and the poang if I bought a new proang poang oh my god Please drink, please rewatch this and drink hydration every single time I say poang. I think I got a lot of bargains today because if I'd have got a new poang from Ikea, which you know I don't buy new unless it's, nobody's going to be giving away oil paints. Well, good ones anyway. Um, I spent, the amount I just spent in the art shop was the amount I would have spent on a new poang wait <laughs> if I'd have gone to Ikea let's start this again if I'd have gone to Ikea and bought a new poang 80 quid right so I just spent 80 90 but even they didn't even have a nice green one so that probably was limited edition let's say so I just spent 20 on the poang 10 on the two canvases the big ones and then 60 in the art shop so basically I got everything for the price of a new poang bargain right bargain I am very happy with that yeah so now we are gonna go back to my flat we are at the Shepherd's Bush roundabout and we're gonna take the poang inside I realized that I left a picnic blanket in my freaking boot and it's gone moldy because it's got damp damp no idea how so I'm gonna put that straight in a wash um, I'm gonna put that straight in the wash because it's a lovely blanket and I don't want it to go even more disgusting than it already is and 
and then we're going to finish this vlog. Oh, I've got to wash up. comments I feel you if you hate washing up too please write I feel you because oh my god it's just never-ending isn't it life it's just well it's never-ending till it ends we have a freaking chair yeah oh god it's it oh it's a bit of a bouncy one so <laughs> so hot I need to just like calm calm I feel like half of this blog is me just like panting so I'm just taking off my feet with my no I'm taking off my socks with my feet there we go success it's not anywhere I want it to be I want it to be there but that's there, so we can't move it there. All right, the second. Hi, I am just finishing editing this. It's the Sunday night, so it's the night of the day you've just watched. Um, I have realised that I have said parang about 500 times in this video. I've even sat in the flipping chair and you have not seen what it's looked like. So here is a picture of the parang. That's it, where I was sitting in it over there, but I've moved it now. It's now here but yeah i haven't yet finished so that's going to be a project for this week i half washed up i did half of it had enough i did my i did my returns that i needed to do i took out my recycling i decanted some soap that i needed to decant i've edited this i did my life drawing here are some pictures i did at life drawing it was so nice, but I was a bit stressed. So I was a bit still from today. But I've absolutely loved filming today. It's been a pleasure. And I hope you've enjoyed watching this. And um, yeah, as I just said, this video has basically just been me panting. So um, I'm looking forward to doing more things soon. And yeah, just... As always, thank you. Thank you for being there. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the love. I appreciate you more than you'll ever know. And I think about this channel and everyone that supports me a lot. And I don't want you to think that just because I go off for six months at a time that, you know, it, this doesn't mean anything to me because it truly does. And that's, if anything, why I stay away for longer periods because I'm like, ah, I need to keep it, you know, I don't know what that sentence was. I'm just, I'm just done for today. I am, oh, don't say done, though. Okay. Um, I love you a lot. Thanks for watching. Bye.